Uh, I just thought, um, you know, we, we threw the first punch. Uh, I thought we defended. And, uh, you know, there's two attitudes you can take in overtime. You can say, uh, and a lot of times it can happen to the team that led going into overtime. Uh, you can say, oh, my goodness, you know, we have to play another five minutes. Or you can put a smile on your face, and it's all in how you respond. You can say, oh, this is great. We get to play another five minutes. And I thought we took the second attitude. And, um, you know, another good life lesson there because half your problems are how you respond to them. So uh, to not finish it but then come back and finish it, I thought the guys showed, you know, a little resilience there. Our big man, they play hard, you know. Uh it's hard to battle with them down there. Um, so I give credit to our big mans. They started the tempo and, you know, the guard play, we just try to feed off of them. Um, the game, you know, it was a little rusty. You know, everybody coming off a, you know, a good Christmas meal and all. And um, other than that, you know, everybody got back in rhythm near the second half and calmed down a little bit. And, you know, the ball was bouncing our way. A hard, like Pete said, it was hard, fault, 16 rebounds. But um, we we got the win, and I'm proud of us for that. I think we're doing good. I think I think as a team, um, you know, we've been through a couple dog fights. A lot of the balls haven't went our way, as in Florida State, you know, Miami, um, but Davidson, um, and then this game. So you know, we 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 seen both sides of it, taking wins and taking losses. Um, you know, we're young, but age doesn't really mean nothing to me. Uh, Everybody's been playing basketball for a very long time, and it's a game of runs. So it's really just about that, that, that family bond and that chemistry that we have together. And when things get hard, we just got to be able to s stick it out together and huddle up and get it fixed, you know, halftime, make adjustments, and just move on because we're going to make mistakes. But, you know, the game goes on, and you learn from them, and our season's going to go on. So I feel good going into conference play. Um, we're going to grow from this, uh, you know, we'll have a film session tomorrow and, and uh, you know, we'll kind of slow play, it, slow, slow play it and we'll hit that pause button a few times. Uh, but, um, you know, I, the thing I just told them right before we broke up is, is teams that have a chance to be good, they find a way not just to win, but they find a way to win and learn. Um, a lot of times you just think you learn from losing, but, you know, Learning from winning means you're saying, all right, we got to win, but there's a humility part that's got to come right after that that says, hey, we can still get better. And that's what I want them to get from this is, uh, you know, let's come back and find ways we can continue to get better at the details because uh, with the next, you know, basically you're looking at an A-10, you know, it's a marathon and a sprint at the same time. You I mean, 16 games in 60 days is what you're looking at. So, um, you know, I just want them to continue to embrace improving. That's what we'll do.